Are any of you brass players? Trumpet or trombone? No? Right. Not. That's so unusual. I always ask my students things like, are any of you former sonar operators on nuclear submarines? And none of them <laughs> say yes. But when I say, did any of you play trumpet in middle school band, usually somebody goes like, all right. So brass players understand this idea that the sound goes beyond the instrument. Okay? So if we use a mute, intelligence algorithms that generate patterns for me. To them I say feed or something worse. I can make algorithms too. I have my two subroutines here that I have bent out of fine copper wire. Alright? Subroutine A and subroutine B and I'm going to cause them to interact in real time composition. <laughs> that's metal inside the loudspeaker. You can create not only this sort of percussive sound, but you can create sort of rhythmic patterns that happen as a result of the mechanical interaction of the stuff that you've got in your And money actually works just as well as hand-bent wire. It's just I have more wire than I have money, which is why I do <laughs> All right, so, um, experiment. I have one cup, <laughs> which you're welcome to come up here and take. And I'm going to farm out the speaker. Is there anyone who, who wants to try 